so prone to it and that is why uh, we, as leaders we always make sure that our young officers soldiers are taught and are told to desist from all sorts of all forms of corruption because they can kill the institution and the UPDF is the, the backbone the vanguard of this revolution. And once we have rotten, then the country is finished. And that's why we are very serious when it comes to the issues of corruption. We get you, uh, we deal with you decisively. Whether you are an ordinary soldier, we shall deal with you. That's why we warn them much, much earlier. Since now they have finished their training and they are going out there, and they will be handling resources, handling personnel and everything. So they must go out knowing that doing this is not correct and is punishable. And it can lead to your being dismissed from the, the forces. So we, can, we, 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 we don't tolerate corruption. It's really for us, it is zero tolerance. It really affects us as an institution, as a country. And when we are affected as a, an institution, then everything collapses. That's just, so that's why I've emphasized on them. As they leave this institution, they should know that there is that problem out there and they should not be lured into it. Of course, what normally brings corruption is people competing, trying to compete with others. You look at the, somebody's lifestyle and you don't know his background and you want to be like him. And that's what brings problems. That's why I tell them that, please, do not compete with others. Compete with yourself. Compete with what you have. Don't look at what does not belong to you. And once you compete with yourself, then you will be satisfied with whatever you have. But the moment you look at others, because this one has a vehicle, he owns a very good house or what, then you end up going into these uh, uh, corruption tendencies. And they will lead you into problems and lead the institution into problems. So, the best thing is to be contented with what you have.